Have you ever wondered if the ground beneath your feet is quietly shifting its sense of direction? Right now, Earth's magnetic poles, the invisible beacons that guide our compasses, are on the move. In fact, the North Pole isn't standing still at all. It's racing across the Arctic at a pace faster than at any other time in human history. But here's the strange part. What scientists recently uncovered about this shift isn't just about navigation. It could rewrite our understanding of how safe our planet really is. Most people don't even realize how deeply their lives are tied to this hidden force. Stay with me because in the next few minutes, you'll see why the poles are moving and why what's happening now is unlike anything we've ever witnessed before. What are magnetic poles? So what exactly are these magnetic poles that everyone talks about? Imagine Earth as one giant bar magnet. Instead of being made of metal sitting on a desk, this magnet is powered by something far more dramatic. A swirling ocean of molten iron nearly 1,800 miles beneath our feet. As this liquid metal churns and rotates, it creates massive electrical currents. Think of it as nature's own power plant, generating an invisible magnetic shield that stretches far into space. On the surface, we see the simple side of it. Your compass needle, it faithfully points toward the magnetic north, guiding travelers, explorers, and even hikers in the woods. It feels stable, Reliable, like something that will always be there. But here's the strange part. This stability is an illusion. Those poles aren't fixed in place. They're restless, shifting across the planet in ways that scientists are only just beginning to understand. The discovery that shocked scientists. Here, where things take a surprising turn. Scientists tracking Earth's magnetic field made a discovery that left even them stunned. The poles aren't just shifting, they're drifting faster than anyone expected. The North Magnetic Pole, once creeping along at a slow pace, is now racing towards Siberia at nearly 34 miles every year. That's triple the speed it was moving just a few decades ago. Think about that for a moment. Something we all assume to be permanent, the very direction of North is sliding across the map like a runaway train. Imagine pulling out a compass on a hike only to realize, years from now, that it's no longer pointing toward the Arctic, but somewhere completely different. And here's the part most people don't know. If this continues, your compass could one day point south instead of north. That's not science fiction. It's a possibility rooted in Earth's restless core. But the real mystery isn't just how fast the poles are moving. It's what this acceleration might be warning us about. Magnetic reversals in Earth's past. To understand what's happening today, we have to look back way back. Deep within ancient lava flows and solidified rocks, scientists discovered something remarkable. These natural time capsules are locked in tiny magnetic signatures, like fossils of Earth's magnetic history. And what they reveal is astonishing. Our planet's poles haven't always stayed where they are. In fact, they've flipped completely hundreds of times throughout Earth's history. Imagine it north becoming south and south becoming north. Entire compasses would have spun around, pointing in the opposite direction. The last major reversal about 780,000 years ago. But here's the strange part. The record shows that these flips don't happen on a neat schedule. Sometimes they occur after a few hundred thousand years, other times after much less. And the process is an instant, like flicking a light switch. It's more like a dimmer slowly fatting down, then rebuilding in the opposite direction. A chaotic transition where multiple poles can appear at once. Most people don't realize this, but the signs suggest. We may not just be watching history, we may be standing at the edge of the next reversal, right now. What a pole flip would look like. When most people hear pole flip, 
they imagine something dramatic, like the planet suddenly tilting on its side overnight. But that's not how it works. A magnetic reversal is far less theatrical and in some ways far stranger. Think of it less like flicking a light switch and more like turning a dimmer knob. The magnetic field doesn't vanish all at once. It weakens flickers and then slowly rebuilds in the opposite direction. During this transition, Earth's magnetic field becomes messy, unpredictable. Multiple north and south poles can exist at the same time, scattered across the globe like a scrambled puzzle. Now imagine living through that. One compass points this way, another points the opposite way, and a third doesn't seem to know where to point at all. That's not science fiction. It's what the rocks tell us has happened before. And here's the truly unsettling part. Animals that rely on magnetic cues, migrating birds, whales, even tiny sea turtles, would be thrown into chaos. Their internal maps would suddenly stop working. Entire migrations could scatter, leaving creatures lost in the vastness of oceans and skis. Picture it, thousands of compasses, both human and animal, suddenly disagreeing on where North really is. And scientists warn that's not a distant fantasy. It could one day be our reality. Impact on our technology and daily life. So, what would a pole flip actually mean for us? Not just animals, but humans in our everyday lives. Well, here, where things get personal, our modern world is practically stitched together with invisible threads of technology. And many of those threads are tied directly to Earth's magnetic field. Take satellites, for example. They rely on magnetic orientation to stay stable and to shield themselves from solar radiation. During a weakened field, those satellites would suddenly be bombarded by space weather. Almost like your phone losing its protective case right before you drop it. Then there are power grids. Imagine the entire planet running on one massive Wi-Fi network. And suddenly, the signal keeps dropping. That's what a magnetic reversal could feel like, a planetary Wi-Fi outage. GPS signals would get scrambled. Planes might lose navigation accuracy. And even your smartphone compass could become useless. But here's the part most people miss. This wouldn't be doomsday. It would be disruptive, big, costly, confusing, yes. But not the end of civilization. Still, it raises one chilling question. If our ancestors survived the last reversal without technology, can we handle one now with everything we depend on? The good news and what scientists are doing. Now, before you start picturing the end of the world, here's the good news. Earth has been through this before, many times, and it's still here, thriving with life. Why? Because we're not defenseless. Above us, our atmosphere acts like a 13-foot thick concrete wall, against most of the harmful radiation that tries to break through. Even if the magnetic field weakens, this natural shield keeps us safe from the worst of it. And here's something even more reassuring. Scientists aren't just watching this happen. They're preparing. Space agencies are developing stronger satellite protections, studying power grids for vulnerabilities, and mapping the shifting poles in real time. Think of it as humanity building a safety net before the tightrope starts to wobble. So yes, a pole reversal would be disruptive, but it wouldn't be catastrophic. We've faced bigger challenges as a species. And this time, we have knowledge, preparation, and science on our side. Tell me in the comments, does that make you feel a little more hopeful? Conclusion So, what should we take away from all this? Earth's magnetic poles have flipped before, and they will flip again. It's not the end of the world. It's simply part of our planet's natural rhythm. Yes, there will be challenges, from navigation hiccups to satellite troubles. But it's not a catastrophe waiting to happen. 
It's a reminder of how alive and dynamic our planet really is. And maybe that's the most fascinating part. Even after billions of years, Earth still has secrets left to reveal. Now I want to hear from you. What part of this surprised you the most? The animals losing their way. The possibility of multiple poles at once. Or maybe the fact that scientists are already preparing. Tell me in the comments below. And if this video sparked your curiosity, make sure to subscribe to Deep Time Earth. Because the next mystery of our planet might be even stranger.